Good morning, this is Alabama Headhunter. We're heading out this morning. Uh, headed, I guess, to West Alabama. I'm going to pick up my buddy in his boat. We're going to go hit a lake over there somewhere. I'm not sure exactly which one. We're getting a fairly early start. Not like I would have liked to, but uh, it's, a, it's early enough. It's still dark. We'll get back with you soon. We got about a two and a half hour drive ahead of us. Wish us luck. It's been a few days since we found any any decent airheads. Later. All right, we've been out here hunting for a couple of hours. I hadn't found nothing. Kent has found two or three, but I think I got me one right there. At least the show looks like one. Let's pick it up and see. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice little stemmer. All right, well, let's keep looking. Yep. Finally, finally get my eyes on the ground or something. All right, I got at least another piece right there. All right, let's pick it up. Kent got a base of a Dalton just a minute ago. Another little stem point. Could have been a drill the way that's made. Yeah, let's keep looking. Now we're about done here today. Kent just found a lost lake. Let me see that. I think it. A dovetail, maybe? Yeah, and it's kind One of the in between ones. And I found the stem point down here in the water. I'd trade it for that dovetail or whatever that is. Man, that's nice. Man, I still like right. I'm going to finally get around to my cleanup from uh, Hunt Saturday. Uh, we went over to a lake in West Alabama <clears throat> that we hunt this time of year. Didn't find a whole lot. My friend found several points. I got three. Uh, found this one first. Got a funky little tip on it. I don't know if you can tell it, but it's kind of got a red color to it. And then I found this broken drill. I think that's a fresh break, but I could not find the rest of it. And I looked everywhere where I come, where I picked this up from. <clears throat> and then I got this point. This was the last thing I found. Made the day. I got a tool. I left it laying in yonder. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. This is actually my buddy picked this up. I just kept it because it's a piece of junk. The material is so red and waxy. We find a ton of this stuff over there. It's over near the Mississippi line. He found a uh, base of a Dalton. He got a lost lake. Uh, what else was it? And he got a, a kind of a busted up pine tree. And several other stem points. <clears throat> uh, Saturday was his day. And then I got home and I had a mailbox find. I uh, got all these pieces from Mr. Rick Jitsu. Uh, there's a lot of pretty cool ropes in here, bases, tips. Uh, I'm not going to go through all them. Here. And then he sent me some real cool tools. 
There's a pretty nice knife. And this is a uniface tool. If you can see the real, real fine edge work around the end of this thing. I think that's pretty cool. Oops. And this uh, graver. Got a couple of little points on it that they used for something. <clears throat> Another flight tool. Camera's being slow to focus this morning. Got a little graver on that end of it. This thumbnail scraper. Oh, come on, focus. There we go. Well, these are from Missouri. This is some wire on that one. Polish from use. It's another pretty cool thumbnail scraper. Come on, camera focus. There we go. This is a pretty big one here. And it's been mapped all the way down that side. This is a pretty cool one here too. And if you look, you can see a little bit of polish on it right there from use. Alright, and then, this is a couple of points I got last week from a friend of mine. These are uh, from Limestone County, Alabama.
I just wanted to call this one Greenbrier, but it looks more like a pine tree to me. And this is the one I really like here. It's got a little Id nick on the base. It's heavy ground up sides up to up to about right there on both sides. Beaver Lake. I can't seem to come up with a good fluted point from up there. I think that's a beauty right there. Alright, well that is it. I will uh, get this uploaded probably tonight. This is, I'm fixing to head off to work later. Y'all have a good day. Well, somebody said they want to see a better picture of that Cumberland. It's on the cover of a magazine. That come from uh, Calder County, Alabama. There's the other side of it. <laughs>